guys you're not gonna believe this i'm your ultimate plug can you imagine living in a well gated secure environment gated community amazing beautiful apartments not far from the highway just a few meters from mombasa road and not having to pay water bills but still have a constant supply of water in your home today's video i'm gonna be introducing you guys to some amazing apartments called sunset boulevard along mombasa road um a two-bedroom apartment going for eighteen thousand shillings only per month so if this interests you which i'm sure it will keep on watching and don't forget to subscribe to this channel leave a comment at the comment section below let's get straight into it hold me close till i get up time is barely on our side there are two routes to approach sunset boulevard the first one you just alight um past Tafon. there is another stage called 39 where there's a petrol station and then you alight and then you just walk down or take a motorbike but that route is a bit dusty because it's not tarmac so i used the route that um takes someone to great wall gardens at the river this is um the route i'd advise especially if you're using a um, tattoo you, you want to avoid the dust or you if you're driving you just um instead of branching off at this point you head on past koloho mall and as you can see here we are at the apartments you don't take you just don't take any time you go straight after koloho mall and you just find yourself here this is how the estate looks like there is parking spaces over there there's like a small playground for kids and then for this block these are the communal hanging lines yeah so there are different blocks they like that they have planted to trees and you know the small small um garden spaces when you enter um this is the sitting room we have one window over there with a curtain box don't mind the state of the house it's a bit dirty the person who moved out clearly was very dirty and did not make a point of cleaning the house so this is the sitting room space let me stand on a corner so what you guys can see this is the sitting room space so you have a socket here and you have this space over here and you also have a socket there so in case you can decide where you want to put your tail you can put it on this wall or you can put it at this side so that's the sitting room space then here is the kitchen again this person was very dirty but let's focus on what's important we have storage here and the sink and then outside here is a small balcony why would someone feel it's okay to leave a house like this so guys this is the main route from the mombasa road highway to the apartments you can see it's not tarmac so it's a bit dusty so instead you use uh, the route that i use which is this route just um besides koloho mall then when you come like this um this is a toilet and bathroom. We have a small sink. Guy, um to sell kwam chafu. Yeah, so that's the the shower place. You can put a curtain, I guess. Yeah. That, so this one serves this bedroom. It's a small bedroom, but and there's auto share bed that I have four by six. This is the wardrobe. That's how it looks like. And this one looks like this. So that's one bedroom. This other bedroom is master and suit. So when you enter, that's the bathroom, which is bigger than the other one. Yeah, it has a sink as well, a mirror, shower, and the toilet. And then 
this is the bedroom space i think the bedroom size is the same it's just that this one has the master ba bedroom it has the master toilet and bathroom but the size is the same so for this bedroom you use this toilet and bathroom yeah and then the sitting room that's it guys i'm just gonna leave this clip here that um show you guys that there's a shopping center nearby just after koloho mall so guys um i thought you should know this if in case you want to go live in sunset boulevard be prepared for a bit of flooding when um there are heavy rains like very heavy rains i think the the apartments are in sort of a flat area so it kind of floods which happens in some apartments i've lived in 360 in Tsukima when it also happens and we survived and considering they are charging 18,000 for a two bedroom although the house is not so big it's still better because you're still living in a gated community and if you have kids they'll be safe you know um but that's up to you in case you have loved the apartments i'm gonna leave um a contact detail of the lady who was showing me through at the description box i believe she's a caretaker or an agent it's just a contact person there is also a bigger two bedroom that goes for twenty three thousand shillings um the space is bigger i wasn't able to film that because she didn't have the keys to that two bedroom but it's bigger and it goes for 23,000 shillings. So in case this space looks a bit smaller for you, you can go and, you know, check out the apartments for yourself. Be the judge. Check out the 23,000 one. Decide. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. Um, please leave me a comment at the comment section below. Let me know um, if you would live in this place. Um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. If you have not subscribed to this channel, kindly do subscribe because... I'm your ultimate plug.